Hello, you are welcome to solve x minus 5 bracket square is equal to x power of 3 plus 1 to find the values of x from this equation. So first, we will expand this x minus 5 bracket square which is same as x minus 5 times itself. So from x times x is x square. Then x times negative 5 is negative 5 x Negative 5 times x is negative 5 x. Negative 5 times negative 5, it is positive 25. is equal to this x power of 3 plus 1. Then it will be x square. This minus this, it will be minus 10 x. Then plus 25 is equal to x power of 3 plus 1. Now this x power of 3 is the largest power so this we take to this side so it will be x power of 3 then this one we take to this side to be minus x square and this one we take to this side to be plus 10 x this we take to this side to be 1 minus 25 which is minus 24 is equal to 0 now from this cubic equation we'll solve it by grouping and factorization then from the factor of negative 24, the factors of negative 24 are many, starting with plus or minus 1, then plus or minus 2, plus or minus 3, and so on up to plus or minus 24. Now let's start to test from the 1. We test from 1 if it will satisfy our equation to give 0. So from x is equal to 1, we substitute 1 in here, here, and here. So it will be 1 power of 3 is 1, minus 1 power of 2 is 1, then plus 10 times 1, it is 10, minus 24. Then this minus this is 0. So 10 minus 24 is equal to negative 14, which is not equal to 0. So x is 1 does not satisfy our equation. Then let's test for x is equal to 2. So it will be 2 power of 3 is 8 minus 2 power of 2 is 4. Then plus 10 power of 2 it is, I mean 10 times 2 it is 20. Then minus 24 is equal to, this minus this is 4. 4 plus 20 is 24, 24 minus 24 is equal to 0. So x is equal to 2 satisfy our equation. Then we take 2 to the left side. So it will be x minus 2 is equal to 0. Now from here, x minus 2 we make as the factor divisible in this cubic equation. So for the first group, it is x in here x power of 3 it can be div divided by x so it will be x power of 3 then this minus x square to be divided to be divisible by negative 2 it will be minus 2 x square now minus 2 x square to get negative x square we must add x square so to give it this negative x square. So we already get the first group, this x power of 3 minus 2 x square is divisible by x minus 2. Now the middle group, we already start with this x square. Then we split again this 10 x to satisfy the middle group and the last group. So 10 x is same as minus 2x whereas this minus 2x is divisible by minus 2 then we add 12x now from for here negative 2x plus 12x is 10x so this middle group is complete to finish the last group is 12x then minus this 24 is equal to 0 now from for here this first this first group this in here x square is common 
So we'll take x square out of bracket. This divided by this is x. This divided by this it will be minus 2 bracket. And for this middle group, x is common. So it will be plus x. We take x out of bracket. This divided by this is x. Negative 2x divided by x is negative 2 bracket. Then plus. In this last group, 12 is common. We take out of bracket. This divided by this is x. This divided by this is negative 2. Bracket is equal to 0. Now from here, x minus 2 is common. So we take x minus 2 bracket out of bracket. Then this divided by this is x square. Then plus this divided by this is x. Then plus this divided by this is this plus 12 bracket is equal to 0. Now from here we have two solutions. Whereas the first solution is x minus 2 is equal to 0. And the second solution is this quadratic equation x square plus x plus 12 is equal to 0. Then to solve from this linear equation we take negative 2 to the right side it will be x is equal to 2. So this is the first value of x in this our problem. And to solve from this quadratic equation by quadratic formula, which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Whereas a is equal to coefficient of x square is 1, b is equal to Coefficient of x is 1 and c is equal to constant is 12. Then it will be x is equal to negative b is 1 plus or minus square root of b square. It will be 1 square which is 1 minus 4 times a is 1 times 12 times c which is 12. Then over 2 times a is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 1. Then negative 4 times 1 times 12 is negative 48. Then over this time this is 2. Then it will be x is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of this minus this. It is negative 47. So square root of negative 47 is same as square root of 47 then square root of negative 1 is i so times i then over 2 so this so this is the other value of x which is a complex solution whereas we have plus or minus now to solve in another method from this our problem which is x minus 5 bracket square is equal to x power 3 plus 1. Now from this side we make in form of a perfect square and from this side we make in form of a perfect cube. So in this side to be in form of a perfect cube we minus 9 and in this side to make in form of a perfect perfect square we will also minus 9 so we minus 9 in both sides then our equation will be this minus this it will be x minus 5 bracket square then minus 9 is same as 3 square then is equal to this minus this it will be x power 3 then 1 minus 9 it will be negative 8 so it will be minus we know that 8 is equal to 2 power 3. So it will be minus 2 power 3. Then the next step from this side is in form of a perfect, perfect square. So we'll apply a perfect square rule which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. And from this side in the, is in the form of a perfect cube. So we'll apply the rule a power 3 minus b power 3 is equal to a minus b bracket 
bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket then from this side this side it will be a plus b is this minus this so it will be x minus 5 then plus 3 bracket then bracket a minus b it will be this x minus 5 minus 3 bracket then it will be equal to from here it will be a minus b is x minus 2 bracket then bracket a square it will be x square then plus a times b it will be plus a is x b is 2 so x times 2 is 2x then plus b square 2 square is 4 then bracket so it will be x negative 5 plus 3 it will be negative 2 bracket bracket x negative 5 negative 3 is negative 8 bracket is equal to x minus 2 bracket bracket x square plus 2x plus 4 bracket then from here x minus 2 is in both sides but this this quadratic equation is greater than this linear equation so we'll take all this into this side so it will be it will be this which is x minus 2 bracket bracket x square plus 2x plus 4 bracket then minus all this bracket x minus 2 bracket bracket x minus 8 bracket is equal to 0 then from here x minus 2 is common so we take x minus 2 bracket out of bracket then we take this divide by this all this divide by this is this x square plus 2x plus 4 then all this divide by this it will be negative then bracket this x minus 8 bracket bracket is equal to 0 then it will be x minus 2 bracket bracket x square plus 2x plus 4 this negative when this it will be minus x negative and negative it will be positive 8 bracket is equal to 0 then it will be x minus 2 bracket bracket x square then 2x minus x it will be plus x 4 plus 8 to be plus 12 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions we have first solution is x minus 2 is equal to 0 and the second solution is this quadratic equation x square plus x plus 12 is equal to 0 then from here we take 2 negative 2 to the right side so it will be x is equal to 2 so this is the value of x same as in the first method and to solve this we will solve by quadratic formula whereas we already solve it by quadratic formula then the answer is this negative 1 let me recall it it will be x is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 47 i over 2 so this is the value of x which is a complex solution thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye